As Kylie Jenner made her public debut with Timothy Chalamet, her ex, Travis Scott, wasn't far away. I can't. Yeah, an eyewitness tells ET that the rapper arrived at Beyonce's concert Monday night in LA just five minutes after Kylie showed up with her new beau. Peep Travis in Alicia Keys' video singing Happy Birthday to Queen B, alongside Alicia's hubby, Swizz Beats, and Beyonce's man, Jay-Z. Travis and Kylie, who share two kiddos together, five-year-old daughter Stormy and one-year-old son Air, called it quits in January. Then in April, Kylie was linked to the actor with a source telling ET at the time that they were having fun together, but keeping things casual. Quote, it's not serious, but Kylie is enjoying hanging out with Timothy and seeing where it goes. I love it. And while the two kept things low-key, speculation about their budding romance grew after Travis seemingly shaded Timothy in July in his track, Meltdown. Chocolate AP and chocolate the bees. Got the Willy Wonka factory. Burn the athlete like his calories. Find another flame out of me. Yeah, that Willy Wonka reference is worth noting since Timmy plays the Candyman in the upcoming flick, Wonka. You see, I'm something of a magician, inventor, and chocolate maker. So quiet up and listen down. Nope, scratch that, reverse it. But the beauty mogul and the Oscar nominee didn't go public with their love until Monday night, when they attended B's concert together and were spotted engaging in some PDA in the VIP section, including a big old smooch. I'm obsessed with it. As for Kylie and Travis, a source recently told ET the exes are co-parenting well, adding that they get along and make their kids a priority. They've both been doing their own things and doing their best to respect one another.